In a tense and highly anticipated Nations League opener at Hampden Park, Scotland found themselves on the losing side as Poland took a narrow 1-0 lead. The match, which kicked off at 1945 British summer time, was marked by a stunning long-range goal from Poland's Sebastian Zamanski, who unleashed a powerful strike from about 35 yards out. Despite Scotland's initial bright start, it was Zamanski's goal in the eighth minute that set the tone for the evening. Scotland began the game with optimism, buoyed by a supportive home crowd and a lineup featuring key players like John McGinn. Early efforts saw Scotland pushing forward, with some promising attacks down the left flank and a couple of dangerous balls flashed across the Polish box. However, none of these chances were converted, and the visitors quickly demonstrated their own attacking prowess. The pivotal moment came when Billy Gilmore was dispossessed and Zamanski was fed the ball. With a clear shot at goal, he took advantage of a lapse in Scotland's defence and fired a shot that clanged off the post and into the net, leaving goalkeeper Angus Gunn with no chance. This early setback proved to be a significant blow for Scotland, who have struggled to secure victories in recent matches. Former Scotland striker Stephen Thompson noted that despite Scotland's positive start, they were unable to capitalise on their early momentum. The crowd's encouragement was palpable, but the visitors' defence held firm. Poland's ability to exploit the gaps left by Scotland was evident, and their goal highlighted the challenges facing Steve Clark's squad. This game was Scotland's first in the Nations League A Group 1, and it follows a disappointing Euro 2024 campaign where they failed to progress past the group stages. The team's struggles were exacerbated by a series of injuries and absences, including the notable absence of key players like Callum McGregor and Kieran Tierney. With the squad undergoing changes and fresh faces being introduced, including debutants, Scotland's search for form continues. Poland, meanwhile, also entered the match with something to prove following their own underwhelming Euro 2024 performance. The team, led by the ever-dangerous Robert Lewandowski, is in a period of transition under new coach Mitchell Probiers. Despite the injuries and retirements affecting their squad, Poland managed to secure a crucial win that could boost their confidence for upcoming fixtures. As the match progressed, Scotland's attempts to equalise were thwarted by a resilient Polish defence and missed opportunities. With the Nations League season just beginning, Steve Clark's side will need to regroup and address their vulnerabilities if they are to turn their fortunes around. The loss to Poland adds to Scotland's recent woes, having won only one of their last 12 matches, a statistic that underscores the pressing need for improvement. As they head into their next fixtures against Portugal and other tough opponents, Scotland must find a way to break their poor run and deliver performances that can reignite their supporters' hopes. Stay subscribed for more videos.